Fairleigh Dickinson University is host to more than 12,000 students on four campuses around the world. The university's metropolitan campus is on the banks of New Jersey's Hackensack River, five miles from the George Washington Bridge, entree to New York City. The university's college at Florham is on the historic Vanderbilt Twombly Estate, 25 miles west of Manhattan. FDU's Roxton College in Oxfordshire, England, is about 70 miles from London, between Stratford-upon-Avon and Oxford. And FDU Vancouver, the newest campus, is in the Yale Town section of Vancouver, British Columbia. Public Mind, Fairleigh Dickinson University's independent survey research center, conducts survey research in the fields of politics, popular culture, social and economic trends. It has become a leading producer of survey information throughout New Jersey, New York, Delaware, and Philadelphia metro area, as well as on the national front. Fairleigh Dickinson University's Public Mind is a vehicle to combine liberal arts with scientific method. The group makes internships available to undergraduates in political science, sociology, communication, and marketing. Dr. Peter Woolley, Professor of Comparative Politics in the Department of Social Sciences and History, is the Executive Director of Public Mind. Topics tend to follow the interests of the faculty and of the public. We try and find that intersection. What's the public interested in? What do we think the public wants to know? What do we think the public needs to know? And, of course, what are our specialties and what are our interests? And so we find uh, in that whole universe of possibilities, uh, the intersection, if you will. Dr. Krista Jenkins specializes in youth politics and the politics of gender, with years of experience in polling and research. Dr. Jenkins is professor of political science at Fairleigh Dickinson University and co-author of A New Engagement, Political Participation, Civic Life, and the Changing American Citizen from Oxford University Press. Um, Public Mind has been interested in looking at the relationship between um, gender and the viability of the Hillary um, Clinton candidacy for for president. And so a lot of the um, experiments that we've been running in in polls involve trying to get people to think about the importance of gender before they actually answer questions having to do with which candidate do you um, intend to support in the upcoming presidential election or the primary election. And we've seen some really interesting findings relative to the relationship between gender and her legitimacy as a candidate in many people's eyes. Another integral member of the Public Mind team is Dr. Daniel Casino, who joined Public Mind and FDU in 2007. Professor Casino specializes in campaigns, elections, political psychology, and experiment survey design. His research focuses on how voters form opinions about candidates and issues and the role of emotion in this process. I'm a political psychologist, so my, re- so my training and research is really on experimental uh, political science. And so for me, I get real excited whenever we see a uh, experimental poll. So we do a lot of these where we vary the question order of the survey. So uh, during the 2006 Senate race, we had a series of polls where we would ask people about the New Jersey Senate race uh, either before or after asking them about uh, national issues. And we were able to use this to really d- understand and really quantify the effect of national issues on the race. So when everyone will do something cool like that, something that no one else is doing, sort of experimental social science, that really is when political science is best, when we're doing this sort of thing, when we're not just guessing as to the effect of something, when we're more than just pollsters, more than just talking heads, when we're really able to bring something new to the table, that's when I get really excited. Depending on the poll topic, Public Mind makes use of other Fairleigh Dickinson University faculty to help in the interpretation of data and to offer expert commentary. Public Mind conducts more than 30 polls each year. In addition, it offers a complete range of research services to government, nonprofits, and private sector clients. This service can range from just a few survey questions to customized large scale studies. Once the poll is conceived and the data is collected, another team from the communications area edits and distributes the poll data to the media. And the media has it covered. Print, television, radio, and the web. More than 150 national, regional, and local media outlets carry public mind polls, and the list grows every day. From the Associated Press, National Public Radio, The New York Times, NBC, CBS and ABC, right to your local paper. 
Fairleigh Dickinson University's public mind can make a world of difference for you.